New York, July 7th. 11 a.m., the start of the Chris Ocean race in the Hudson River 5 MOD 70s. The boats are lining up. The start is about to happen. The pressure is rising. Spindrift Racing is leading the charge to the start line. They've been working on this project for 12 months and today is the day. We are now seconds away from the start of this transatlantic. Race for water. Ideally placed to leeward of the fleet is really close to the start line. We are now five, four, two, one, go. Race for water, cross the line first, but look at Group Edmond, the Rothschilds powering in the middle of the fleet and sailing away. Meanwhile, Spindrift is in trouble. Group and Monza Rush Charles takes the lead, race for water and Foncia are chasing just behind. Group and Monza Rush Charles turn around the Marinac of Marks in first place, closely followed by race for water and Foncia. In the light southwesterly breeze of six to eight knots, the boats are sailing away at 15 knots of speed. With its swirling breeze, the Hudson River plays on the nerves of the tactician. As a fine sailor, Sidney Gavinier takes the lead and flies away. Under the Verrazzano Bridge and already 3,000 meters behind, Group and Mother Rothschild and Race for Water are neck and neck before the boat heads offshore. Five hours after the start, the fleet has already split into two groups separated by 10 miles. Race for water and Missenden are battling for the lead. 